Well, the, the the topic was quite broad. It was more about you know how how does open in in the widest sense can help companies, organizations, governments, and etc. to move into a better future, into a better world, to call it a little bit more philosophically. So um, my main topic was, you know, open source is here, open source is here to stay. How can we all learn from it and make the best use of it and move forward? And how can we all learn from open source? Well, effectively, we don't learn from open source. Open source brings us back to what we have been doing for thousands of years, sharing knowledge and etc. The weirder part is that in our modern lives with intellectual property laws and monopolies and patents, we have lost this possibility of sharing. So open source effectively restores the sharing that made our society big. So we don't learn that much. We learn from ourselves and that's the best thing to do. Um, so sharing or the community aspect isn't that new. But what is really new that brings open source into this aspect or into the economy? We have computers nowadays. We have computers we can program. And um, we are moving away from standardized solutions that one big company delivers and you have to use it. You know, the days of the mainframe, the days of IBM and etc. We're moving into a world where people want flexibility on every possible level and they're willing to do it themselves. They're willing to put their hands in to make them dirty and do stuff. And that's why they're moving into open source. We see many organizations having lots of innovation internally in, with their own people and open source is a way for them to get that innovation out in the open in their own company, in their own organization that's what we call inner sourcing, inner sourcing as, as a typical method, but also to the rest of the world when they see what we are doing here is of general use and not competitive to my direct competition, then they can share it with everyone and open source allows them to do that. That's maybe the one thing that we bring to the table. You mentioned also some studies, some surveys in your presentation. Uh, what are, uh, in your opinion, the most interesting results in this? Well, the, the, the most fascinating result is uh, uh, the numbers that I gave, uh, so it's a black duck uh, survey, uh, open source survey, and, and the number one most important result for me is um, that 50% of the companies are willing to give back to all open source communities. They're willing to share the stuff their employees are doing during paid working time and share that with the rest of the world. And the second important thing is why are they doing this? Because they know it's the only way to attract and retain development talent. Now think about that for a second. The only way to get good developers for your company is when you understand how open source works. That's the biggest compliment we can get. Finally, a short uh, review uh, or your opinion on this conference so far. I've met a lot of people that I only know virtually from, from my Twitter and Google Plus and, and, and wherever, so we had some very good conversations. Um, the venue is, is perfectly wonderful um, and everything just works and so far we heard a lot of good information and good input and I'm hoping that during the rest of the day we get into more interesting conversations and start sharing knowledge because that's what we're all about. Thank you very much Jan. Thank you.